how to paint an alpine watercolor in 5 minutes 19 seconds. So how do I paint an alpine watercolor in just 5 minutes and 19 seconds? <laughs> Obviously this is a joke because as you can see this is a, an accelerate video. It took me around 40 minutes to be painted with just two brushes. I started with the big brush because my initial aim is covering uh, the whole surface very quick using this kind of mild colors don't put a contrast very quick it will come later on yeah well I'm saying that and as you can see I'm painting a bit dark but because this path was really dark Sun was striking very much Le Dent du Jamon it was covered of grass everywhere so that's why I am mainly using green colors but in any case what you have to be focusing is painting shapes not objects why because if you're focusing on painting this little object there like this little stone or this uh, bunch of earth or that flower there um, I don't think it's gonna be a, a, a nice thing because maybe the results are gonna be too realistic and old-fashioned way especially when you're playing with a watercolor that it has to be free as a bird uh, in some cases at the beginning uh, when you're using these um, colors that are a bit too uh, dark play with um, some um, paper to take out the the color and to dry it out very quick without changing brush as you can see I am starting to add some contrast especially at the first term that means the the part of the picture the part of this color that is closer to me why because with this we are gonna establish this sense of depth I have changed the brush now is a small one I am playing around with the sky which it was very boring and also playing around with the uh, lightest part of the stones and the funny thing here is as I am adding more and more contrast as I am getting more and more detail especially on the closest part of your point of view you have to do it in a very patient way little by little it's like that joke how do you eat an elephant do you know the answer well, it's easy. You eat an elephant bite after bite. So here I am doing the whole thing. I am bite by, by after bite. I am brush after brush, playing around with the herbs, playing around with the um, details, especially on the closest part of my point of view, playing around with some shades in the small um, uh, stones of the path, playing around with different tonalities of this green in order to enhance this uh, richness of the nature. But, um, you know, as I said, little by little getting uh, to the point where I'm going to be satisfied with it without really being obsessed of getting really close um, representation of reality obviously you see now uh, I almost finish the closest path of my point of view and is very detailed way and the father's path is really not detailed so I'm gonna do like a kind of transition playing around with some more detail and some more contrast on the second path of this watercolor but not that much it has to be like a transition you know that crows up there really far even if the reality is not so just a hundred meters as I said so little by little I am playing with details I am in the uh, contrast putting again some more flowers here and there yellow 
and red and getting close to my final decision of stopping we're arriving to 5 minutes 19 and the watercolor is over in order to put the name La Dent de Jamont, the date and signing